Oh, you too. What's up? What's up, you too? It's good. Anyway, man. I don't know what's good with y'all, but today, man, I'm kind of excited. I'm about to join uh, LA Fitness today. Hopefully, I can start recording and get some footage. I'm, I'm not sure how packed it is in there, but hopefully, we can start recording today or tomorrow. Today is back day for me, and that's primarily what I want to talk about. I want to talk about building your back. You may say, let me drink this pre-workout. I'm going to make this pre-workout. And uh, I'm going to talk to y'all in the car. Stay tuned. All right. Just got done working back. Uh, LA Fitness, I just joined there. Uh, today was the first day. That's why I didn't record when I said I was going to record. I just went on ahead, got the membership, uh, worked out. Did my cardio, and now I'm back in the car. This fitness connection is, I mean this, sorry. This um, LA Fitness is in Carrollton. And it's okay. It was okay. I mean, it's not packed like uh, most gyms are. I mean, you pretty much have the, the space to move around. But forget all that. That's not what I'm here to talk about. I want to talk a little bit about back. A lot, a lot of people don't realize is back is a muscle that we don't see every day. We, it's a muscle that we don't see. It's a, it's a non-show muscle, but it's very important. So the first thing we need to realize or to, to develop when we try to work our back is mind-muscle connection. A lot of people go up, come in there and say deadlifts is more, most important. Uh, I can agree to disagree with that, but uh, to each his own. Uh, I don't personally like to do deadlifts myself. I prefer rack pulls, but uh, if those, uh, my lower back was messed up a couple years ago, but that's an, that's a whole nother story. Uh, I said first tip is to get your back warmed up. First go in there, try to establish a mind muscle connection with your back. I usually do that by doing uh, pull ups or uh, pull ups and uh, just some lightweight rolls, you know, just to get your lats engaged, your upper back. Uh, mid back engaged. I try to do that first. Pull ups. That's that's gonna be your building. I mean, if you can't do pull ups, you ought to be shot. I mean, that should be the first thing that you try to learn are your basic movements when you get in the gym. Pull ups was number one. Uh, basically, you of course your biceps gonna be involved when you're doing pull ups, but you want to try to uh, minimize them as much as possible. Uh, try to try to hang try to just use uh, your hands as an anchor that's gonna be the best way uh, just try pulling pulling up I was gonna do a, a little small tutorial on how to do it but it was uh, it wasn't packed in the gym but I haven't got quite up to par with recording in a new gym yet so or any gym at all for that matter but I will be because I I'm be joining another gym probably uh, Friday but anyway I said, uh, once you get those uh, pull-ups down pack to get the to get the the thickness of your back, you want to do a lot of rolls. Rolls, man, that should be the base of your workout. Rolls, 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 rolls. Everybody should know about rolls. You got dumbbell rolls, barbell rolls. It's different machine for rolls. Uh, T-bar rolls. There's so many different variations of rolls to hit each different part of your back. You really want to hit um, each part of your back, uh, upper back, mid back, upper lats, lower lats, uh, lower back. You want to hit, that's that's the key to building that overall solid foundation of your back. Uh, people, Like I said, people will talk about deadlifts all the time, but I know a lot of people, I'm not going to name say any names, but a lot of people will develop that back without even having, doing deadlifts. I mean, a lot of deadlifts. You know, I can I can say it about myself. I mean, I don't have the the best. Be I mean, far as uh, definition, I have it, but far as thickness, I'm still working. I mean, that's what bodybuilding is about. It's about working, and it's it's a it's a it's a marathon. It ain't no sprint. So, you know, working working that that's you no know, that's 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 good. So, uh, those vertical movements are what's gonna be the target of getting that wide 
getting getting spreading your lats, getting them wide. Uh, so you really want to, oh shit, you really want to make sure you incorporate every movement. For me, for back, I do maybe I do probably about seven to eight movements for my back. I mean, that's that's my very high volume day. One day I specifically uh, focus on a lot of rows. The next time I do back, I focus on a lot of vertical movements. But you 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 have to keep it keep it balanced. If not, you're gonna have an off off back. And bodybuilding is about being symmetrical from from up up upper body to lower body. So I don't know what they told you or or how they explained to you. Uh, but I mean that's that's the base of it. That's the base of it. And making sure you feel your back. Like every time you want to make sure your your basically your arm is only an anchor. That's all. Your arm is or your hands are anchors. That's it. You want to make sure you pull with your elbow. I mean that's the key to like I said, building your back. So try flexing the mirror, posing the mirror, do a lot of uh, back double biceps, uh, lat spreads. Etc. Try to develop that mind muscle connection with your back because like I said, that's one that we don't see a lot We don't see that unless you turn around and it's still we don't see it. So like I said Try to do that and and eat and you you're on your way to developing a, a good back Like I said genetics play a role in that as well But I don't believe in that that crap as well. I don't believe in that I still train hard as if I can develop the best back in the world whether I know the uh, genetics is gonna get it or not whatever so yeah man everybody man as long as you remember or try to be the hardest worker in the room man you can't go wrong man just try to work harder than everybody else i know every gym even this gym today i went in and i knew for a fact that i was the hardest worker in there i caught everybody's attention in that gym that's not the that's not the goal of the focus but i know i caught everybody's attention in that gym so I don't know if my physique did it. <laughs> I did. I trained in a stringer today, so I don't normally do that. But uh, whatever, just be the hardest work in the room. Peace.